Hey guys, how's it going? Superfly Kev here, and welcome back to Resident Evil Force uh, Separate Ways. So let's just jump into it. So last time we rung the bell, which uh, initiated bingo time. Everybody's favorite time of the day. Alright, so chapter two. Discovered by the Illuminados. You must be talking about that vagrant Spaniard. So where is he now? He's held captive in an abandoned house located northeast of the village. Until he recovers the sample, we can't let him die. You don't need to remind me. Luis, Sarah. And I thought I was high maintenance. Oof. Alright, so we have to rescue Luis. Or Luis. You want to pronounce his name correctly. Alrighty, so we have to go over there. Alright, we'll take the chicken egg. It's always good to have some protein. I said open. Okay, that's what we're opening. Hey, so you were here listening to my conversation Welcome. the whole time? You cheeky bastard. Good things on sale, stranger. What are you selling? Um, I don't know if I should keep these. What are you buying? Mm -hmm. Treasure map two. Is that all, stranger? Sure. <laughs> Thank you. We'll buy the second treasure map so like that we can find more Is goodies. That... And we'll buy another healing item. <laughs> Thank you. Come back any time. Alrighty, uh, so this is the correct way, right? Uh, no, but there's a treasure down here, so we have to go f the other way. But let's go get this treasure. And I think I know which one it is. Ooh. We gotta shoot the crows. Because they drop stuff. Oh, come on. I'm not moving the joystick, she's doing that herself. I am playing this on a controller. Maybe I should put it. The only reason why I'm not playing with, with keyboard and mouse is because of the quick time event prompts. They're a lot easier to deal with with a controller. All right, so you shoot that first and then you shoot the pendant because if not, it falls into the water. Here's that awful smell again. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it smells delicious. I could probably climb down through here, but I have to take care of Mr. Cool first. I guess that's who she's, uh, I guess Mr. Cool is, uh, I don't know if she's referring to Louise or she's referring to Leon. Either way, they're both cool. All right, let's sell them the, uh, what are you selling? the pocket watch. Ah. <laughs> what are you buying? And now we can buy ourselves a is TMP. Yes, that is all. Can I get the stock as <laughs> Thank well? You. No stock. Oh man, it's not going to be as accurate. Okay. Hmm. Was there something here? There was. I would have missed out on that. That's 2,000 bucks. That will help out a lot. Because we need to still buy, like, the the bigger case so we can hold more stuff. Check. This is the first table I've ever seen that's not covered in filth. I know it's really pristine, isn't it? Is anybody taking a piss in here? I don't know why she's in here. There's a urinal, not a toilet. I'm sure there's challenges for her using that uh, facility that way. The toilet is filthy. The concept of hygiene is lost on these villagers. But this room, though, this room is super clean for some reason. Un All right, come on, just die. Okay, cool. Anything in here? More money. 
250 that time. And we'll get this grenade. Alright, oh, uh, no, that doesn't have a drawer. But this... I can take the golden egg. And I'm sorry, bird. But I gotta do this to you. Now I feel bad because you didn't drop anything. Okay. I remember Zeus. You were standing in the exact same place for Leon's playthrough. Alright, so I'm gonna do the same thing I did last time. No! Okay, actually I did get him. I thought I threw it way too soon. And I was gonna be a waste of a grenade. Good thing with Ada said so I don't have to upgrade my weapons. I don't know how effective the weapon is. You know, compared to the base stats to when you upgrade it. Ooh, I got a ruby. Alright, it's... Alright, before we take care of that man, I'm not missing any treasures. Okay. Because last time I missed some treasures. Because I didn't buy the treasure map. Alright, there's somebody coming out of this cabin. It's a woman with a knife. I got a knife too. Alright, we'll trip him now in a second. There we go. His friend saw me. We'll do the same thing to him. Come on. Oh, man. Oh, God, I missed. I was about to say too easy, and then he basically dodged it. Oh, my God, there's still people coming out of that freaking door. Oh, you missed. You missed. I know. But you don't have a pitchfork this time. Alright, come on. Okay, cool. I think that's the all the villagers. Alright, we're going back to the village. By the way, last time, um, if you remember when I started the encounter when I was running towards the back of the house, um, I was trying to catch a glimpse of Leon running away from the Ganados, but I was too slow. The, uh, but he runs behind one of the buildings. It's one of the reasons why the Ganado was just running away because of that reason. She was running after Leon. Okay, so in this house, in the back, there should be a treasure. Alright. Let's see if I can stealth this. There's not, there's no stealth mechanics in this game. But let's see how, if, if I can get, no, okay. Yeah, the minute I came across this guy's peripheral. Oh, oh, oh my god. Okay. There's a lot of people here now. I'll eat a chicken egg. Come on, reload. Alright, that's all my PMP ammo. It came in with the clutch. Nice. That was perfectly executed. Just like, you know, it's almost like if I was a playing as an assassin or something. I don't know what Ada's job is. She's just Ada. That's her job. Oh, is that where I put all the gems and stuff at? The ones that I collected? All 
I heard footsteps. Was there somebody else in the house with me? There's somebody there. Oh no, never mind. I thought there was a person there. Alright. I can't open that. Alright. Alright, there was a thingy back here. Alright, the combat music is still going, so there must be still a Granado somewhere. Alright, so it wants me to go up this way. Okay. Alright, there's a guy inside this house. Come on. Damn, dude, you got knees of steel, bro. Alright, I'm just gonna shoot a few times so I can do as much damage as I can. Alright, more monies. The merchant's gonna love us. Ooh, shotgun shells. That's why you gotta check the huts, man. Oh, and by the way, my uh, my moderator Swastix uh, yesterday was asking me, why do I always look to the side? It's because um, well, I used to have a laptop. Now I actually have a second monitor. I actually upgraded it. Uh, somebody gave a monitor to me that they weren't using. And I was like, thank God I need a second monitor. It's a little monitor, so it's not taking too much space on my computer. I mean, on my desk. Oh, there's an egg. Yes. Eggs are quick heals. They don't heal too much, but they, they, they heal just enough. Alright, I got the spindle. I don't know if that was worth alerting everybody because it's just a spindle. They're only worth two grand each. Oh my god, there's a lot of dudes here. Alright. I don't have any explosives, but I got a boomstick. This thing doesn't do that much damage, though. I have been shooting these guys to hell and they're still coming. Nope. I'm gonna dodge that fucking thing if... If you don't mind. Alright. It's good crowd control, it really does push them back. Wow, that echo. Don't understand why he sounded like that. Oh, you son of a bitch. No. Okay, he missed. I was gonna I was trying to heal before I took damage. Okay. Is that everybody? I mean, the music is still going, so there might be maybe like one or two people left. Hey, cow. A brown chicken egg. Are you gonna lay another one for me, chicken? No? Okay. There will used to be a dog running around here. He doesn't seem to be here this time. There was something on the on top of this building over here. I noticed when I was fighting these guys. There it is. It's a shiny. How do I get the shiny though? Hmm. Maybe I gotta go up, shoot it from up this ladder.
Okay, more money. I don't want to hurt you, chicken. Last time I did, I felt bad. Because, you know, if I if if I had the option to eat you, then it wouldn't be so bad. But the game gives me no such options. Come on, turn around. She didn't want to do her 180 degree quick turn. Ooh. All right. So let's climb up this ladder. And let's see if I can shoot whatever it is up here. Uh, I can't tell if I'm going to hit it or not. Nope. I can't really tell. Do I need a rifle for this? Oh, I'm just wasting ammo. I'm just wasting ammo. And let me guess, is that a treasure for me to get? No, that's not the treasure. I guess that's just maybe a spindle or something stupid like that. Yeah. I think it wants me to use the rifle here. Alright, where's the treasure? It's down here. Cool. Alright, um, let's check our keys and treasures real quick. Do these things go on this? They do. Cool. Now we can sell that at a high price. So I'm guessing this is where we go, right? Because I can't possibly be able to go to the other way. And the reason why is because, remember, Leon needed Ashley to open the door for him. And uh, Ada doesn't get an Ashley. She doesn't have access to that uh that mission asset. You know, the ballistics. Even though Ada, I mean, she her ballistics are not as as refined. Okay, so this is where Leon meets uh Luis. Okay, I shot the dynamite out of his hand. Can I do the same thing with the guy in the building? Am I that skilled? Let me see. Come on. I need the dot. I need the dot. Oh, there's a guy coming from the side of the building. Okay. Come on. Come on. Closer, please. I'm not gonna run to you, man. You need to come over here. Okay, I am playing as a queen. And you have to treat me as such. Thank you. I did it. I hope everybody in, you know, everybody's applauding at, at, at home. Oh no. Oh crap, that almost killed me. That almost killed me, ladies and gentlemen. I heard someone running. Okay. I hate these guys. These are the worst. These guys and these Gatling gun guys are the worst. Come on, dude. Just explode. God, that's the longest fuse in the world. Now he's going to blow up. Okay. Alright, last time I shot the spider, but the spider really doesn't do anything. Uh-oh. I think he killed himself. Alrighty. Oh crap, there's somebody behind me. Thank God I know Spanish, because that helps out a lot when the enemy speak a language you, you understand. Alrighty. Alright, 
these guys are still alive. Alright, thank god I haven't activated the, the parasites yet, so we don't have to worry about, you know, them coming out. I think by the time we get to chapter 3, they would. Oh, I didn't mean for, for me to trigger this. I think the door would have been locked if we tried it. Or there's Leon and Luis. If you guys remember, they got knocked out in the, uh... In the original campaign. So this is exactly what they were up to. So now... Now I gotta go the opposite direction. So I gotta go all the way back where I came from. And save these two bozos. Alrighty. But since the door is open to the house, we can go and see if there's any goodies inside. Is there even any treasure in there? Hmm. It's a treasure right there. Okay. Oh, come on, Ada. What the hell are you doing? I know I'm the one that's controlling you, but still, I need someone to blame. Well, I'm not going to use my shotgun. Okay, cool. Would have been overkill just to use the shotgun on him. He didn't deserve it. Okay, let's save it. Okay. More shotgun shells, good. So there's no trip wires this time around. There Damn, dude, you startled me. That was really loud in my ear. Damn, that freaking kick she does. You can feel the power behind it. Okay, so... Is there any reason why I came in here? I think so, but... I can't go to the wall. That's like a different area. Wait, what was that? Oh, nothing. I thought there was like a hallway or something there that I missed out on. Alrighty, well, let's get out of here. Uh, we don't need to be here anymore. What we need to do is that we need to go backwards. By the way, this uh, if you guys are wondering, this was not in the GameCube original. They added this later when they ported this to the PS2 as an extra. That dude has dynamite. So it wasn't really DLC because, you know, it's not downloadable, but it was on the disc when you bought the PS2 port. So in case you were wondering, oh, okay, now it's time for the shotgun. Oh, you know what? There we go. Nice. They're still alive. Motherfucker. N now they're dead. Yeah, when I didn't see their, their bodies like melting into the ground like that, that's when I knew. They thought they, thought they could fool, fool me, but... Nah, I play this game long enough for me to know when I'm being fucking... When I'm being bamboozled. I'm trying to shoot it from his hand. Okay, cool. And they killed a guy in front of me. Alright, so there's obviously going to be more people down here. No? Oh, and this is open. I don't remember that being opened. A spindle. Alright. 
I thought I heard somebody. It was a stupid chicken that was making the noise that it sounded like someone was approaching me. Or oh, there's something on top of that roof. Cool. Alright, let me go kick this guy. Alright, that killed him. What's that up there? That's probably either ammo or spindle. Hey, he has Leon's jacket. So there you go. Now you guys know what happened to his jacket and why he was only wearing it in the beginning of the game. Alright, they're coming. Nice. An egg. Alright, let's go grab whatever's on top of here. It was ammo. Alright, so... I wonder how many of you guys were right. No. Hey, where did you come from? You weren't there two seconds ago. Some of you guys are fast, man, and you guys are like old people. But then again, you know, you guys do have a parasite that's giving you superhuman strength. Alright, there's ammo on top of that chimney. Damn, dude. You don't approach somebody with a shotgun like that. That's how you get your head blown off. Uh huh, eye frames. You can't hurt me if when I'm kicking. Oh. Whoa. Nice. Okay, he died from the fall. Alright, a dragonfly. Oh, there was something in here. There's a bunch of stuff in here, actually. Thankfully, a snake didn't pop out. Alright, there's nothing useful inside there. There's nothing useful inside there either. Alright, we need to grab that jacket back. That's where I need to go anyways, right? Yes. Ooh, that was close. Oh, Mr. Jacket Man is back. Alright, you guys asked for it. Alright, I wish we can grab the jacket and give it back to Leon. This looks like Leon's jacket. Why is he wearing it? Would have been funny if Le if Ada would have picked up the jacket and she would have just given it a good sniff and she would have been like, oh, or something. You know these two have a thing for each other. Ada and Leon. They just pretend they don't. Because, you know, they're on a different side of the same coin. Alright, there he is. Alrighty. So, now you guys know exactly what point of the story Leon's at right now. In case you guys were wondering what they were talking about, I'll tell you in a second. Outsider. Just remember, if you become unpleasant to our eyes, you'll face severe consequences. <sighs> what? 
Same blood. Yeah, it was the guy with the rifle that shot her. That's my guess. But if you guys were wondering what those two guys were talking in Spanish, they were basically just saying, um, did you hear that there's an intruder amongst us? And basically they were just discussing how awesome it was to have the parasite in them. And it's so much better than, you know, how they were living before. Oh, you guys cut my beautiful leg. Okay, shotgun time. Alright, so remember that one area that I was trying to get to right there? Yeah, this is the place. What's that? A cat's eye. Nobody's coming. Oh, okay, there's a guy right there. It's hard for me to see him because I have all these lights in my face. So you guys can better see me. Come on. And boom. Yep. I am running out of pistol ammo. Excellent. Let's put some stuff away, or at least like organize our stuff a bit better. I guess I put the chicken egg there. And let's equip the TMP real quick. And then the shotgun, so like that we can, uh, we can, uh, what do you call this thing, um, open up our inventory a bit more. Come on. Bad kick, hopefully this kills him, it did, I kicked his head off. Alright, do I have to go down here? There's a treasure. Alright, we'll explore. I'll save on the way back. Actually, let's save now, just in case the game puts me in the, uh... In an awkward position, because I really don't remember much of this, uh... Of this DL... We'll call it a DLC, even though it's not a DLC, per se, because, like I said, you didn't download it. You bought the PS2 port, and it was on the disc. The door won't open. It must be locked. I need to find the key. Okay. So we'll find that key, and then uh, I guess when I come back here, I'll probably do a quick jump cut. Because there's probably not going to be anything interesting on the way back. Like, no enemy encounters is what I'm trying to say. Oh, hey. I got the iron key. Okay. Since it's not that far of a distance, I probably won't do a jump cut. I thought I was gonna like do it way later. Okay, cool. Yellow herbs are good because they give us more health. Welcome. Got a selection of what are you selling? Alright, we're selling Is this. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Thank you. 
green cat's eye. I don't know if I should sell that or not. <laughs> I might have you. to put it into okay? some other treasure. <laughs> Thank you. What All right. We're Is going to okay? buy a bigger case. <laughs> Thank you. Is that... Yes. So we're probably going to be able to buy everything this guy offers right now. <laughs> Is that okay? Yes, that's all he has right now. So let me put the eggs up here. This, uh, we'll put that there. And the grenade, we'll put this here. By the way, I found out there's a game on uh, on Steam that's called Save Room, and it's pretty much um, it's pretty much this. If you guys want me to play Save Room as a stream or something. But yeah, let me know because pretty much all it is is um I think the game is like two or three bucks. It's really cheap, and all it is is pretty much this inventory management, but as an entire <laughs> Thank game. You. What are you selling? Which Come I think is is genius. Time. It's genius that 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 actually is a thing. And I think it was made by one guy too. But yeah, I I recently found this out because I was researching some Resident Evil Four stuff. And, um, not, you know, for the original game, and then it came up, um, in some video. I forgot what the video was. Alright, I do have the key. I don't think there's a boss fight here. Because, I mean, that's Leon's thing. All right, I think the treasure is back here. Oh, another yellow herb. And a red cat's eye. Can I go inside this building? Oh, I, I have to come in here. So this was ends the mission. Wait a minute. There's a whole bunch of stuff here. Can I even access it? All right, I'm going to do a jump cut right here real quick. All right, there's no reason to board a lift if it's not going anywhere. All right, so I guess... I guess I can't go up here yet. I probably need a key. It looks like the lift needs a key to activate it. All right, that answered my question. Okay, we'll go back right in front of the door. Okay, we're back. So we're opening this door now. Oh, there is a boss fight. It's a chainsaw sister. All right, well, that's not too bad. Okay, now we got now we got uh, Las Plagas. Okay, we took care of that. Okay, I got I got uh I got I got trouble. No, nope. oh, that was close. I thought I thought I was gonna get caught. I got TMP ammo. All right, let's do this. Let's go up the ladder first, though. Okay. I think I killed a chainsaw lady. I did. Oh, the real final boss. Old man with a dynamite. Okay, I killed him. That was an easy final boss. Jeez. Okay, that wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. I mean, this game is... Not, I mean, the the this little mini campaign is not as hard as the... The actual campaign is, even though I'm playing it on professional. It's meant to be a bite size extra. But it's canon, so I'm playing it for you guys. It, so that's it, there's nothing else here. Alright, well, we're gonna run up just in case they, um, I'm not gonna cut this time, just in case they, uh, you know, they throw a few baddies here so like that you guys can see the obstacles that the game developers 
provide it. See? There we go. If I would have if I would have jump cut there, you guys would have missed that shot. All right, we'll save once we get past the uh, the gondola. Oh, great. All right, well, I got something that can take care of you in a second. There we go. All right, are you going to drop something? No? Well, your friend did. I mean, we have all the... Uh... Oh, this guy's blind. Damn. That flashbang affected this guy all the way over there. Oh, come on. Come on. Alright, Mr. Merchant, are you still in there? You are, okay. I just wanted to make sure he was safe. Okay. I wish I could just jump over the rail, but I gotta go all the way around. Okay, this is what I was trying to do before. Cool, I don't have to shoot anybody. Like I did that one time with Leon and, and, and uh, Ashley. That saves us a lot of time. Alright, what's my next goal? Am I supposed to go to the castle? No, I'm supposed to go to the cabin. The cabin where everything goes down. Because, yeah, I think we meet up with Luis afterwards, if I remember correctly. What's this? A spindle. Alright, let's check behind this cabin before we do anything. And then we'll check with the merchant to see if by any chance he ended up restocking. Alright, TMP ammo. Uh, no safe room music. When I came here with Leon, they had that awesome music they play. Ada doesn't. Ada doesn't get anything. She just gets ambiance, I guess. Alrighty. Uh, episode's gonna be a little bit longer than uh than the last time. The first chapter is not as that long. It was like thirty minutes. Welcome. I find it creepy how sometimes his eyes. Or red. What are you selling? Is that all? <laughs> Alright, we're not gonna sell the cat's eyes because I think we're gonna have to use those. So do I Oh I do the hook shot. But which way do I go to though? Oh I can't go that way anyways. I really hope there's not an El Gigante in here. If anything, just give me a bunch of dudes to fight. All right, anything to shoot, any treasures. I think there is a treasure here somewhere. It's in the other, like, platform. All right, we got shotgun shells. It really it really helps having a, uh, a grappling hook. There was something here. Oh, there we go. Okay. Ammo. Perfect. Let's check the other hut real quick. Ooh, a box. Cool incendiary rounds. They're gearing me up for something. I didn't see this red herb. Okay. They probably will throw El Gigante at me. El Gigante. <laughs> Fucking Shrek looking motherfucker. There we go. I got the last cat's eye. Now I just need to get the thing that I put the cat's eyes in. Nothing? Oh, I went backwards. 
Okay. I was about to say. Alright, so we should just go straight through because I already got the treasure, so there's nothing for me to look for over here. Yeah. Okay. Alright, what button? A. Okay, it's X this time. Okay, I think that's it. Alright, that roll was completely unnecessary. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. But anyways, we took care... We took care of him. Oh, well, I wasn't anticipating a freaking... Boss fight here, so... Gotta make sure we go the right way. It's easy to get turned around here because it looks the same in both directions. All right, let's do some little bit of inventory management. So, put these here, put that there, put that there. I'm gonna have to reload both my shotgun and my TMP just so we can make some room. Alright, that's a hundred. I mean, that goes to show me that these are the, just the base stats of the weapon then. If I remember correctly, I think the TMP by default only holds a hundred. I may be wrong. Alright, so before we go into the cabin, let's grab the treasure that's right here. Oh, never mind. You guys go on it. Lewis. Hey, senorita. Got a light and some smokes to go with it to make my day? Where is the sample? Okay, we skipped the foreplay. As a matter of fact, I was just going to get it. Where's the love, baby? Sounds like fun to me. Just hurry up. Okay, lady. Where do you stand on all of this? Exactly what kind of group are you working for? There are some things in the world better off not knowing. This is one of them. <laughs> Fine. I can take a hint. I don't care who you are. As long as you get rid of that old man and his religious friends. <sighs> Alright, that's the end. Um, I don't know if I... I am able to get that treasure maybe next step next chapter but yeah that's chapter two guys among all the people involved in this Luis Serra has the least entanglements he works for no organization preferring to move on his own I'm the one who told the organization of his importance I did it because I like him his history betrays an enthusiasm I once shared it was a stroke of luck that I happened to intercept his email for help. It seems he can't trust the police, so he sent the email to an old friend from college. He must have thought his friend was still alive. At any rate, that's how I managed to find him. Apparently, he's been conducting his own investigation of the cult while doing research on Las Plagas. A brilliant scientist. He's accumulated a pile of data and pieced it all together. Must be why Sadler hired him. Hmm. Too bad Sarah's snooping has aroused his suspicion. When I told him who I was, he practically begged to be taken into custody. He needed protection. He said, I have no love for Las Plagas or this stupid cult. I want out. I just want peace and quiet again. 
I ordered him to bring me a master plaga specimen, a sample for evidence. Looks like he's one of the few people whom Sadler actually trusts. Tracking him down and getting my hands on the sample shouldn't be difficult. I doubt the cult will take kindly to his escape, though. I'll have to guide this along if I want it to go smoothly. All right, so this is just pretty much everything she just said. Save, yes. All right, guys, so I'm going to leave it here. Um, as always, don't forget to like and subscribe if you guys like what you see. And if, uh, if you're a Resident Evil fan like I am, um, tell your friends about this channel. Um, you know, I'm pretty much playing through the entire series. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.